Good morning ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another day of the video, Darren, how's it going today? Today we're off heading to work, it's 20 past, we're heading off ever so slightly earlier than normal, um, potentially get an earlier bus, who knows, um, but it depends, all that crap, you know what I mean, <laughs> um, to be honest with you, I woke up, I was pretty tired this morning, I had a dodgy dream that told me that I had to stay, I had to snooze my alarm for longer in order to look after a baby. Which I saw, I, I realised that it was a dream because there are no babies in my flat at least as far as I'm aware but I was very bewildered <laughs> to say the least um, I think I'm still accustoming myself to coming back from the 10 hours of sleep that I might be having when Laura was here to the 6 hours a night that I have now um, I'm still getting used to that I think it's going to take me the weekend to get used to it as well So. We shall see, won't we, ladies and gentlemen, because that is not changing. We, we live on six hours. Deal with it. Um, <laughs> but yeah, what's going on then? Last night I was writing my blog in bed. Um, it's looking good, to be honest with you. I potentially might release it today. All I need to do is finish it. All I need to do is like the last paragraph. So I could release it tonight and just start work on the next one. Like, why do I... Why am I intrinsically setting it up so that it, I upload the same night as a, a main channel video would go up, even though one isn't going to go up and it's got nothing to do with the main channel video? You know what I mean? Because <laughs> I'm used to always time them so they'd come up on the same day as a main channel video, but normally they're related to main channel videos. So balls to it, ladies and gentlemen. In the description down below, there is a link to the blog post that I've been writing over the past couple of days and it's about starting to blog again it's about getting back on the bike or back on the productivity train after a long couple of months of Christmas of not doing much so that's what it is it's also about project management and how I'm managing my time and the projects in which that I'm taking it on um, talked about it a bit yesterday but the blog post is down there so now I've got to finish it haven't I <laughs> got to finish it on the bus um, and then I'll get back and then proofread it. Otherwise though, ladies and gentlemen, what's going on today? Today we have mappings to do, as per usual. I'm starting to think that I can just map blindfolded now because I'm an absolute beast at it. Like, you can't, you've you never seen anyone like change like five files. Because it takes about five files to do, well, yeah, five files to do each mapping. Um, well, six, I guess. Um, but you will never see anyone create edit those files as fast as i do i've got like the perfect desktop setup so i can just roll from one to one to one to one to one and then all the places so i've got like the button all sorted out so i can run the test and oh man i'm so used to it that i can just burn through and ben's like you're going so fast and i'm like ben man i can't slow down <laughs> I'm, I'd, you can't there's no brakes on this train man but yeah it's harking back to like oh shit i forgot to download the latest docs version on my nexus hopefully it does that in the background uh, um anyway <laughs> uh, da -da 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 -da. hawks back to the old thing i was saying about how the students seem to work a lot faster than everyone else does or at least me and mccallis do oh lewis burn um but yeah so it seems like we work a lot faster but also in my defense or his defense i have mapped absolutely everything <laughs> i've done so many mappings i just know how to speed produce it now i even have hello i even have an excel sheet designed to help me map things faster that's how much i've mapped things in the past how much i've needed something like that but yeah i am going to download Ah, oh, I forgot to download the latest version of my Google Docs. Shizzle whistle. Shizzle whistle whistle. Um, so I'm going to have to do that on the bus. I'm going to have to let it use my um, uh, mobile internet if the bus's Wi-Fi doesn't work, which it never does. So, Whew, at work now. Um, blog is finished. I just need to vet it on um, WordPress before I actually post it. So, hello. But I should have time to do that tonight before tomorrow, yesterday's daily vlog goes live, I think. So, yeah, it's been released tonight. Woo! That bus. Well, I was about to say it's like a spaceship, but um, 
It's a 58 plate, it's actually an old one. It's not even old, 58. It's a really weird bus though, really weird. Anyway, things anyway that, that get you. It's been the highlight of my day, that. And I am not even kidding, because today has been one of them days. <laughs> it's just been, whoa. So, what's been going on, eh? Got in in the morning and we had like a couple of things to do on the to-do list. We had three things to hit off. Uh, the last one being the final set of mappings. Because all of our mappings for everything else has all been tested, we've literally just got car modifications to go. Um, <sighs> but first things first, we had to link up or change the linking up of our uh, deep link, the link that clicks through the system, basically. Um, yeah, it's, it's the link that sites like Go Compare or whatever will give to you that allows you to click it to buy the link, right? So we were giving the new world, there's like two worlds simultaneously at the same time at the moment. There is the world that's currently live and then there is the new version of the system which is going to be released in like a couple of, in a month or two. Um, we were given links for the new world stuff. However, they want to use the old world links and they're going to use like clever redirects to convert that to a normal link. Um, to, uh, they want to use clever redirects to change the old word links to new world links when it hits, the, when it hits things, ugh, stuff and words, basically. Um, means we have to change the link. Um, but the reason they're making that change is because they want to be able to flip back between new and old world if something goes wrong, basically. If everything goes, to, everything goes haywire, we go live, and we realise that um, our link doesn't work, uh, the new world link, something along that chain doesn't work, we can revert back to the old system instantaneously just by literally flicking a switch. Um, so that's what they wanted. We were concentrating heavily on the fact that they might want to flick this switch and, well no, no, first things first, I got there, checked it in, got that working by literally nine o'clock. Bear in mind I get there at about quarter past eight. So I got that all working, all chested, all everything checked in by nine o'clock. <sighs> by ten o'clock we hear that about this flipping thing that they want and we spend the entire day refactoring so that you can have both the new world and the old world links at the flick of a switch. <laughs> if you want it. <sighs> so anyway we get to about uh, we get halfway through this, someone wants to update their packages, we update the packages, it breaks half of our stuff, we have to fix like a couple of things because they moved some data variables from one object to another object, uh, broke all of our stuff, we have to fix all of that, got that all sorted and stuff. We then refactored everything so that the links worked new world so that we could test it locally, um, check that all in and then we had to figure out then how to simultaneously test new world and old world without physically changing which worlds we wanted because obviously that's a server side setting you don't want to just flick that switch in the middle of tests because um, it throws things haywire and we spent ages on this breaking things ripping it apart refactoring oh it was a nightmare we go to the boss and we're like look this isn't gonna work like this is really complicated can we just do the php the old world link and he's like oh yeah i don't want you to do the the this well like what <laughs> he says you guys aren't going to be the ones that do the flip of the switch we will be elsewhere but if you want to flip the switch really really quickly then you're going to want to flip the switch we're going to have to change all of our code so that it actually produces new world links and not old world links and then, it's, then it needs to be tested, and then it can go live. That's a really slow cycle. And he goes, oh, no, no, no. We just want the old world. And then later down the line, we'll spend a, like a week or so flipping it over if we need to, when we want to. And we're like, no. So we'd literally broken everything since um, my bloody check-in at like nine o'clock. Broken absolutely everything. And we're like, he wants to go right back to that version but because we'd done the nougat package in the middle of the day that fixed the change that someone else did we couldn't just revert version because like while we only wanted to really change two two files 
it relies on config files which are fucking a nightmare <laughs> and we literally at two o'clock had to go oh okay rip it all out start again and <laughs> it was so gutting and then towards the end it got to four o'clock and me and ben are just like losing the will to live can't even concentrate on it anymore we were not firing on all cylinders at all it's just occurred to me that it is really cold um my hand is like going to drop off in a minute um and yeah so at four o'clock we're like man we've still got tests failing because it's just being a pig cup of tea <laughs> like we just went and had a brew and just freaking stood in the kitchen for like 10 minutes went back and once i'd got everything green again and working the old world way exactly how it worked at nine o'clock in the morning it was can high fives all round lock your computer wait for the bloody bus because we are out <laughs> so oh man it's been one of them days it's been bloody long and difficult and stressful and we literally got nowhere because we went right back to square number one <laughs> that's like one of the, it just kills you when that kind of thing happens my vlog and hair it feels like I'm just gonna, legit feels like it's gonna drop off yeah oh shit needs to put the oven on then I was about to say like what what am I having for dinner <laughs> I thought I was having curry tonight but obviously not we're having chili chili do I have garlic bread yeah I do um what was I gonna say I was gonna say something I ought to take my uh, <laughs> my recycling out. What do you think? That's what I'm going to do. That's why I've still got my coat on. I'm going to get pans. Do I need the pan on the go as soon as possible if I haven't? If I'm doing not doing a curry, that's the question we're going to ask ourselves. Uh, I'm so tired. It's been it's shit. It's been shit day. <laughs> it's the worst when you spend all day wrapping your head around how to do something really hard. And then at the end, it's just like, no, I don't want it. We don't want it anyway. Don't even know what you're doing it for. <laughs> oh, it's like, no, we just want this instead. Undo it all. But you can't undo it all because you've already half broken it all. You're going to have to revert everything. You just have to you know, build it from scratch. No, 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 no. That was the most casual no, 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 no. I think I've ever experienced. I need to take my recycling out. Oh, I've just finished my dinner and just finished doing my um, sandwiches for tomorrow, which is good. Uh, however, I forgot <laughs> to come in and vet my blog post. So I'm going to do that now and the link to it will be in the description down below. It just didn't go alongside yesterday's video, which to be fair is fine for the simple reason that it doesn't actually belong in any way shape or form with yesterday's video or this video it doesn't really belong with a video it's just a standalone blog about how i'm thinking and feeling and that's what my blog's for these days it's what it's supposed to be for it doesn't have to go with stuff I, it probably will go with main channel videos every now and again um like the uh video i'm currently planning in my head will be a blog post as well um but that is just purely so i can get twice as much information uh, well the same amount of information out to two separate audiences so that I can keep this the main channel video interesting without feeling like I have to slam it with information because I can just link to the blog post in which I, in which I talk about everything in much more detail um but yeah that's my plan I'm gonna do it and then I'm gonna send it off I'm gonna wrap it up and put it onto my blog oh it's been a long time since I posted to my blog so it's excited heating is coming on um well, I was gonna highlight what I something that I've noticed uh, I'm not sure whether it's the cold weather or not right but because it's not on this hand which is why I don't think that because on this hand here you see that little patch there that like patch of red there you go look at that it's like a rash like dried skin I reckon that that is from walking and vlogging in cold weather I'm being harmed by my own format because like where it's thingied would be where like like relative to where I hold the camera that's the bit that takes the brunt from the cold weather well with the exception of my fingers around the camera itself but <sighs> you're a violent <laughs> it's very violent it hurts man it's quite uncomfortable um putting moisturizer right and everything it's not doing jack not doing jack Shoo! I was gonna do a clothes wash tonight wasn't I nine o'clock now 
YOLO. I'm going to put my pyjamas on and I'm going to do a clothes wash. YOLO 2K14-2022. Um, <laughs> and that is my plan for this evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to pop my pyjamas on and I am going to wash it because I'm going to wash this t-shirt because it's dirty. Um, so I may as well get it thrown into, into wash. Got jeans in the wash as well. Basically everything I'm wearing, except my hoodie, wash. Um, which means pyjamas. Tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen. Um, Oh, by the way, I got that blog post onto the... <laughs> it's on my blog now. It's links in the description down below. You can go check it out if you want to. Tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen, it's the last day of the week. It's Friday. At last. <laughs> it's been... To say it's such a short week, it's a long week. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, tomorrow feels like Thursday to me. But it's Friday. So I don't know whether that's a good thing or not. Um, but it's been a long week. I think adjusting to um, the, the amount of time I sleep when Laura's here compared to the amount of time I sleep when it's just me going to work every day is massive. <laughs> it's about four hours. Um, uh, well, yeah, four hours actually. Yeah, that's, that's probably an accurate guess. And I am yet to accustom myself to that. I'm getting up in the morning. I'm extortionately tired. Also, on a side point, me and um, Laura are trying, oh well, we're trying to force ourselves to, to create and get used to new nicknames. Um, <laughs> specifically, like, um, she was tr we're trying to think of ones for each other because, like, when we're together, we just call each other babe all the time. And we, we started that for irony reasons, just because it would be, like, every we didn't like it when people called each other babe. I used to always call her lovely. Then we moved to babe, and it was just, like, became an ironic thing where we're like, babe, and stuff like that. But we're changing it up now, <laughs> and we're trying to get used to it. And I'm, I'm Lamb, which is a name that stuck with me for a while. Um... References to like childhood and stuff and my middle name, I guess middle name Well Kind of my middle name um, Barreled in with my first name combined and shortened. I'm gonna I'm just starting to try I'm starting to get used to calling her law instead of um, Laura or lovely or babe, I guess um, So that's fun law or law law <sighs> So that's something that's going on in my life also, which is something that I actually didn't mention yesterday because I did it after my um, vlog. I have here on my Nexus um, four different rings. I have the time on this one and that's the second hand going around. So it's 21 o'clock and it's about 10 past. Um, well, it's 11 you can see up there. Um, but yeah, it's about 10 past and then that's the second going around. I've then got three countdowns. I've got the countdown to when I go back to Nottingham for my birthday. Although my birthday is in 14 days, I go back in 13 days. I've got the countdown until Laura next comes to me and this beast one here at 184 is the maximum amount of days before Laura moves in with me. So 184 days from now, at least 184, no, at most 184 days from now, Laura will be moving in with me and we will start flat hunting. I say moving in with me, she'll use this place as a base while we hunt our, hunt our, um, next flat out and I've got a countdown for it because I'm super excited it doesn't fit in my phone yet because my birthday is on there too um, so once my birthday is out of the way I'll have that on my phone too because on the phone I've only got like two two countdowns uh, I've got more stuff on my phone's the home page just like that or well I could fit them like up here and up here but my OCD would trip me out um, so just thought I'd let you know about that I don't know what day it is today but you can figure out what day it is in daily vlog days. We'll be in the range of 1,400 then. I think so. I think. Yeah. 1,400. Quite comfortably. Um, but anyway. <laughs> I'm going to get going. I'm going to put my washing in quick because it's getting late. It takes about an hour and a half to do. Which means it's going to be finished at 10. 10.45. It's not too late is it? Oh no, it'll be finished at 11, because it takes an hour and 45 minutes. Well, shut up talking about it. Get it done, man. Catch you later.